Hello and welcome back to your own channel Indian Defense Analysis where we bring to you all the latest development happening in the defense sector. Recently we have made a detailed video on S400 SAM surface to air missile system versus Brahmos missile. If you have missed it the link can be found under the description section. Today we will be talking about Rafale versus S400. We have made detailed video on Rafale as well as S400. The link for both is available in the description section do check them out if you want the feature of rafael which makes it such a potent fighter and distinctly ahead of many fighters of its generation is its spectra self protection equipment countering threats to rafael aircraft this system is jointly developed by thales group and mbda for dassault rafael fighter aircraft this is a very complex system but if i have to tell you in simple terms it's basically combination of various sensors and radars such as radar warning receiver laser warning missile approach warning system infrared missile launch detectors phased array radar jammer and a decoy dispenser for threat countering these all sensors feed their data to spectra which you can think as a central processing unit based on the data received from its sensor and its large database spectra create an excellent situational awareness and even suggest what countermeasure to be used in fact spectra is as good as advanced sensor fusion using f35 if we talk about s400 the component that makes it distinctly ahead of other defense system is its radar the radar of s400 can detect track aircraft rotor craft cruise missiles guided missiles drones and ballistic rockets within the distance of 600 kilometers the 91N6E panoramic radar has a declared anti stealth targeting range of 150 kilometers for a ballistic target speed of mach 14 and rcs of 0.4 square meters its detection range is 230 kilometers and for a target with a rcs of 4 square meters it's 390 km if we talk about rafales its rcs is 0.5 meter square which means the rafale can be easily tracked by s400 system several hundred kilometers away then the question is how can rafale perform seed suppression of air defense mission first Indian Air Force need to use its signet platforms like Falcon Avox reconnaissance UAVs and even satellite network to locate SAM threats inside Chinese territory and proper planning of flight path for Indian Air Force Rafale should be determined to avoid hot SAM sites radar coverage second Rafale has to fly low the terrain following function integrated with rafale's flight control system actually flies the aircraft closer to the ground or sea than would be reasonable for the crew flying in manual mode and it does so with a demonstrated safety level even in blind weather the s400 radar would have difficulty in detecting rafale at such low height from such long range third rafale's threat library system needs to be updated with s400 radar systems wavelength frequencies india can use its own s400 systems to do it and in fact it can practice seed missions on its own s400 system to know its effectiveness and weakness s400 system consists of three different types of radar therefore in seed mission there must be three rafales each carrying jamming pod tuned into jam the frequency of three different radars of s400 once the s400 radars are jammed they can be completely blind and can be taken down like a piece of cake with the help of spectra's active cancellation technology rafale can deceive the radars by giving false echo returns in active cancellation technology the mirror image of incoming wave received 
from adversary radar is produced and then both cancel each other out interesting part is that if we use sufficiently fast computer and a sufficiently strong emitter the fighter jet can stand right in front of radar and it won't see a thing this technology was proven in an exercise mis 13 in slovakia fourth self protection system should be improved on rafale the next generation jammers like bright cloud should be installed bright cloud has been developed to protect platforms against these modern tracking systems dispensed from a standard 55 mm flare cartridge bright cloud has been designed to draw threats away from host platform generating large miss distances fifth using ground based electronic warfare suites as in the beginning of the video i have mentioned that rafales can be detected by chinese s400s the moment they cross or take off from ladakh to prevent s400s from detecting rafales while they are crossing ladakh samyukta ew suites can be used samyukta is a mobile integrated electronic warfare system it is the largest electronic warfare system in india developed jointly by drdo bel electronics corporation of india limited and corps of signals of indian army each system operates on 145 ground mobile vehicles which has three communication and two non communication segments and can cover an area of 150 km by 70 km system has the capability for surveillance analysis interception direction finding and position fixing listing prioritizing and jamming all the communication and radar signals from hf to mmw sixth rafales can also use storm shadow or scalp missiles for attacking s400 system from long standoff range the set of s400 using rafale is not going to be very easy and we can say it will be like clash of titans it requires precise planning and execution the real world war scenario could be different and there are chances that rafales might get detected even after applying all the counter measures in that case china will send interceptors to counter rafales though chinese jets are no match for rafale in dog fight in fact rafale is even better than f35 in dog fight couple of su30 mkis flying at back of rafales loaded with astra mk1 can aid to take down any chinese interceptors scrambled this was today's update please let us know what is your views about these in comment section feel free to post your comments and suggestions about any topic related to defense sector on which you want to hear from us with this i would like to say goodbye and jai hind friends please like and subscribe our video if you have not done already we'll be soon back with more interesting and amazing development happening in defense sector